Our very own Columbia Police Department is hosting a women's symposium on September 13th to celebrate the cont contributions of women in law enforcement. So joining me this morning is legal advisor Jasmine Kearse and Sergeant Rebecca Robinson to tell us more about it. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having us. Of course. Thank you so much for being here. Absolutely. So first things first, tell us about this women's symposium. I know this is the first year that you all are putting on this event. What can women expect from attending? Absolutely. So what we're doing is we're bringing in a lot of females and executives executive command positions to talk to all female sworn officers. For uh -huh. example, um, one of the individuals we have coming is Major Tara Craig. She's with the South Carolina Department of Public Safety. But she's not only the first major for the Department of Public Safety, mm -hmm. but she's also the first female captain. She's also um, the first woman to stay on highway patrol uh -huh. um, as while she was pregnant. Mm -hmm. And so, you okay. know, these are things that are specific to women in policing, and we want them to talk about those. We've got these women who have been in executive command for 30 plus years, those who are first to do it, you know, first female to be in these different roles and positions. And so we're so excited about it. I will tell you also, Captain mm -hmm. Alicia White is going to be our keynote speaker. She's got a tremendous story. So she was actually indicted for Freddie Gray's murder. Mm -hmm. um, and so she went from being in that role to then having the case dismissed by the prosecutors. And then now she serves as captain over the internal affairs for Baltimore Police Department. And so we are really excited because we've got some great, I say, heavy hitters that are coming yeah. in um, to talk about just female in policing and what that looks like and what the future holds. And you know, when I first heard about this event, I was like, this sounds like you know, something that's needed within this career field, the, the police force. So kind of tell me what really is the reasoning behind having an event like this? Yeah, so I think um, we hear oftentimes we talk about glass ceilings, you know, yeah. for women. And so seeing these women shatter those things, mm -hmm. um, it is so necessary that they have conversations that are specifically tailored to one, being a woman, and then two, being policing, because mm -hmm. it, it's multidimensional. And so we are excited that they can talk about issues that are just germane to females in in that field mm -hmm. and have those safe spaces, those conversations that oftentimes you don't see happening or you don't get to participate in with just a female audience. And so that's what we're excited about. So Sergeant Robinson, kind of tell me, what are you expecting to get out of this women's symposium? Well, I'm hoping that we look at the different opportunities to promote women in law enforcement. Mm -hmm. You know, for us um, women that stand in the supervisor positions, we're always thinking about how we can keep moving to the next level. Mm -hmm. So obtaining that, those experience it those different experiences and knowledge from these people in different positions can just uplift us and show also the community that you know women are here in law enforcement we're moving forward and it, we're just going to keep you know pushing in, in our department and throughout law enforcement so and that's our department specifically we're looking at that as a great initiative is to push women into law enforcement promote them into law enforcement and give them the opportunity and the training so that they can keep progressing in a career with us and this event is for women that are in law enforcement no matter where you are not just here in the midlands but maybe across south carolina anywhere anywhere it's an open forum you have the opportunity to um register for the event it's on september the 13th again at 8 30 a.m on busby street and all the details will be there and it's on our web page as well so if you're interested in partaking in it you know come we even are going to feed you lunch Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> well perfect well thank you ladies again so much for being with us anything else you wanted to add about this event no i just want to tell anyone who is interested please sign up it is you can find it on eventbrite it is friday september 13th uh, 2024 so this year mm -hmm. um, it's going to be at 8 30 starting and ends at 3 um, and so there's going to be several vendors that we're bringing in as well um, mm -hmm. that are specifically catering and tailored to our female officers mm -hmm. um, and so we love that and we love that they they made those adjustments just for them um, and it's going to be at our Busby Street Community Center, okay. which is 1735 Busby Street here in Columbia. Perfect. We'll make sure to have all that information on our website. So make sure to go to WISTV.com if you want to know more about this event. And thank you all again so much for being with us. Thank you for having us. Yes, of course, of course. All right, we'll be right back.